noticed that a lot of musicians actually recognized that Mobad had talent. This one is undeniable. A lot of them realized that he had talent, especially the ones that we are quite older in the music industry. You know, when you have talent, you can already see when someone like you also have talent. You know, when they say real recognizes real, I think that's exactly what's applicable in this situation. And a lot of them never knew that he was going through a lot of bullying. I observed that he loved working with Rexy, the music producer, and I'm guessing he's maybe Rexy is one of his favorite producers because I've seen them in lots of videos together. And if you don't know who Rexy is, he's that person that he sang this uh, KPK song with that that looks okay, Kupo K song. Yeah, he's the person that he sang it with, and it's like he even handed the song over to Rexy. By now, you guys already know that besides being very close friends, Mobad and Bella Shmoda were colleagues in the music industry, and in fact, if you guys don't know, they worked on 
music together there's a music they have together called pariwo emma and pariwo i don't know how to sing it and then i think it's more than one song they even have together Zlatan is also another friend and music colleague. In fact, they have a song together called Account Balance. Yes, that's the name of the song, Account Balance. You can go and check it up if you're interested. And it's quite nice to see that he had people in his corner from the music industry. <laughs> You don't understand. My Sadoka is you know, the respect. I know, no, no, you just see. You see, we're on the same. Mike, Mike. I'm always here, Papa. He's always strong. 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 This mobile death has made a lot of people to come to the realization that the music industry is indeed a very deadly place and is filled with a lot of people who are very envious of each other. There are also those who don't want others to succeed. There are also those that will try their best to keep their colleagues down and this has made it very difficult for real talents to succeed in the industry and we really thank god that although mobad faced a lot of difficulties 
there are also people who were willing to work with him from this video you could see that he worked with artists like Chike, Zoro, Zlatan, Belash, Moda, and you know and some other people that I don't even recognize I think there are others who are also upcoming artists in fact the amount of music that Mobad released before he died sorry he didn't release them the amount of unreleased music he has is unbelievable in fact every single day you hear a snippet of one of the music you'll be like was he pushing out music every single day honestly it was almost as if he was preparing for something that we don't know of because the level of consistency but century the fact that we heard mobad hasn't gotten his royalties from the malia music i really hope that any song that will be released now that he's dead the proceeds should go to his family i hope his manager and his team makes sure of that don't forget to like and subscribe guys and stay tuned for more videos come to realization that he's not coming back mm. that's like that's the part that's the part that gets me you know like he still had to believe that he's gone you know i remember i sent him a message sometime in april he didn't send me, he didn't send me any message i just sent him i went to his dm and i said yo good work stop works young king keep doing what you're doing you know keep up the good works you know and he replied said, thanks man thanks boss you know for me like i saw what he was doing and there are many angles that could, I, I can look into it that, and, and I would be, he's just going to get me down. Yes. Do you want to come to it as a father? You're a father? You want to look at it from the father's side? A young father? You know, what happens to the boy? What happens to the kid? You know, you want to come from, you know, the, the fact that he's coming from the ghetto, you know. Now, someone is gone. A lot of people depending on him. So there's so winner. many, yeah, like it's, 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 just, it's just sad. You know, we should not be losing people. We should not, um, he, he, he doesn't deserve it. You know, and, and it's, a, it's, a, it's a very sad one. You know, but I'm happy everybody's speaking up right now. And, uh, you know, coming together as a voice, saying no.